In 2001, Gene Laureano was injured when he fell off a ladder. He was paralyzed from the waist down and hasn't been able to walk since that fateful day. He's been confined to a wheelchair and has never had the opportunity to walk with his son. Now, thanks to the new invention called the Rewalk Exoskeleton, Gene was finally able to stand up. I was asked by a Stephanie Pena if I was interested in a pulmonary research. She brings me up here to the seventh floor. As I passed that door right there, I saw these things with sneakers on. And I grabbed my wheelchair and stopped and asked, what's that? Um, what was left for me to do was beg because I, I just had to get in this thing. So um, they obliged and that's how um, I started. My son is not at a loss for words. And um, when he saw me stand up, I don't think he realized how tall I was. Um, he had nothing to say, he just kept looking at me. Um, yeah, after, after the session he had a lot to say. And like I said, hopefully one day I can take that walk with him instead of bringing him here to do it. That's the goal, hopefully. Gene is part of a program at the James J. Peters VA Medical Center in the Bronx, where a small group of paraplegic patients get the opportunity to use the rewalk. The rewalk developed in Israel is a bionic system that attaches to the legs and manually moves the person forward. The device is only available in medical institutes because it hasn't been approved by the FDA yet for home and public use. Teresa Hannigan recently met President Barack Obama while on a visit in Israel to show the Commander-in-Chief the rewalk in action. When I was over in Israel, they told me there was about 250 people that are actively um, using the rewalk. Um, and that's when I talked to the President and, and I said to him that they have an advantage because they can, they can take it home with us, with them, and use it, and we couldn't. And he asked me why, and that's why I told him, I said, you know, we're just waiting for FDA approval. In this backpack here, it's like a regular school pack that the kids wear. It weighs about six pounds. That's the only thing that you feel as far as weight. You don't feel any of this weight at all. Um, in here is the computer and two batteries. The batteries last for up to three hours of constant walking, which nobody does three hours constant walking unless you're doing a marathon. They test you and they find out the perimeters. They, they find out how high, in order to get my foot to clear the floor, how much my knee has to bend and how much my hip has to bend. Once they calculate all that, they feed that into the computer. Those are my parameters and all I do is strap on a watch, turn it on, and I'm ready to go. This is my main communication with the computer. I turn on the watch, and if you look at the watch, see all the different silhouettes that lit up? Mm -hmm. Okay, right now it has a person sitting. This is in a sitting mode. So if I want to go to a standing mode, I just hour over to a standing mode. There's a walking mode. There's an up mode, there's a down mode, and then there's a manual mode to help me get in and out of it. Okay, so what I'm doing right now is I'm just placing my crutches in position. Um, the device actually will lift me up. So um, what I'm doing is I'm putting my crutches in the position so this way I can just push a little bit and it will stand me up. So now I'm going to take it out of the manual mode that I was just using to get into. Yeah. And now I'm going to go into a stand mode. Press the button. It communicates, calibrates. and it stands me up. That's better. All right, now I'm ready. Um, I can manipulate myself any way I want. Like I said to you, it's not walking me, I'm walking it. I have complete control. I want to stop, I just don't, I just don't shift my weight. You know, people ask if it's an effort to walk. As you can see, I'm talking and walking at the same time. I'm not losing my breath. I'm not losing synchron, you know. It's, once you start walking and you learn how to do it, it's just like the wheelchair. It becomes part of you. You don't even second guess yourself. You just go. Where we're finding that our metabolism's working better. The, um, I have an insulin pump. I shut my insulin pump off because I'm using less. I was having kidney problems. My kidneys were failing me. Um, and it was because I wasn't absorbing um, my medication because my metabolism slowed down. So now that I'm up and I'm walking and moving, 
all of a sudden, hey, I'm starting to absorb medi medication, less pain medications, um, blood pressure medications. Uh, I mean, I, I can list my pulmonary function tests have been coming back better. The medical benefits, I don't think when he, when Amit uh, invented this, he ever thought that it would not only just get us up walking, but give us the medical benefits. I mean, this is really phenomenal. On your mark, get set, get ready, go. <laughs>